Well, here I am just playing Dead Space 3, which you guys are aware that I'm playing, and my grandmother informs me I have something in the mail. I don't know. Uh, it's... Whatever it is, it's one something. I don't remember anybody saying they were sending me anything. <clears throat> it's got no address on it. Um, it. It's... I don't know where it's from, really. I don't know. I can't tell. Unless uh, P.O. Box 20679 something. I don't know. I've got something in the mail, so let's open it. People send me stuff. What we got? Oh, yeah, that's right. It's from Dan's. Thanks, man. I completely forgot you said you were sending me something. You guys are like, what is it? Just a second. I couldn't see uh, anything. Yeah, it's from Daniel. I forgot you said you were going to get me something. Total 10 bucks. That's not bad. Uh... Oh, you bid it on this? Winning bid, $6.14, shipping and handling, $3.99. Oh, it was an Amazon auction. Hmm. I don't know, it says bid. I don't know if you just bought this or whatever, but that was inside it. Very cool. Thanks a lot, man. A lot of you are like, what is it, Brett? What do you get you? <laughs> Y'all are going to probably laugh when I show you, but he got me uh, Dino Crisis 3. I've been wanting to check this game out for a while. I'm a big fan of uh, the Resident Evil series, and I've recently come into the Dino Crisis series when Daniel sent me Dino Crisis 2, and I found Dino Crisis 1 at replays. If uh, anybody knows where I can get a booklet for Dino Crisis 1, and I need a case cover and booklet for Dino Crisis 2, let me know. But uh, Dino Crisis 3, I understand, is apparently horribly bad. It's just, uh, I've watched videos on it. It looks good to me, but uh, it's cheesy. It's uh, set in space, you know. It's, it's zombie dinosaurs in space. But it looks neat to me. I'm going to see if it's backwards compatible. But uh, thanks, man. I didn't, I completely forgot about this. You know why I completely forgot about this? Because I was playing Call of Cthulhu, and now I'm playing Dead Space 3. But yeah, I hope this is backwards compatible, because I would like to play it. You know, zombies and dinosaurs in space, kind of my forte. A nice big booklet. That's one thing that I really miss, is booklets. Um, as you guys can see, it's, a, it's not in color, but it's a nice big booklet. If I could turn the pages properly for you guys. What drives me crazy these days is, uh, like Dead Space 3, um, there's no booklet. There's, uh, two slabs of paper, one that had my, uh, online pass and weapons and stuff on it, the warnings, and then there's just nothing in there. Really disappoints me. Um, I've heard a lot of people like, oh, well, booklets aren't necessary. No, booklets aren't necessary. But they were manufacturing them for several, several years. Like, uh, I recently got the Sega Genesis, and the uh, Genesis games have booklets in them. What's the excuse these days? Oh, well, we're trying to cut back and uh, preserve paper, and, and it's, uh, it's a, lot a lot less cost-effective. Okay, well, if it's cheaper for you not to give me my booklet, and if it's cheaper for you to make these really, really thin, shitty cases, then do me a favor and start charging less for video games. $60 is ridiculous. I'll pay it, but... You guys go much higher, I'm going to quit buying your fucking games. I remember when games used to be $30 brand new, and uh, that's a little bit ridiculous. Anywho, all, uh, all video game discussion-related content aside, thanks a lot, man. I'm happy to have this. I completely forgot that you said you were going to get me something, and now I've got Dino Crisis 3, and it looks fucking cool. Uh, pretty good disc. Yeah, Capcom. Capcom used to make good stuff. Probably not this one. I haven't played it yet. But still, Capcom used to make good stuff. But yeah, Dino Crisis 3. This is very cool. Thank you. Thank you a lot. I appreciate it. Love you, Daniel.